Hello Kalang friends, uh, welcome to my channel. Today we'll see results uh, of our summer color long uh, which lasted almost for three months uh, of summer and um, the theme was Italian holidays. Everyone was supposed to color something connected with Italy and it was quite um, a variety of topics uh, that you could color starting from ancient Roman Empire, uh, mythology, food, um, cities, architecture, uh, people, whatever, until our days. <coughs> I've got uh, 83 illustrations, uh, though to be honest I expected more, uh, but it turned out some people had difficulty in finding something um, to color for this prompt, uh, though mm, I thought like pizza, uh, it would be quite easy to find in coloring books. Uh, maybe because it was summer, maybe um, the theme was not too much inspiring uh, for some of you. Uh, nevertheless, 83 illustrations, quite a good number of works, and we'll see everything <laughs> connected with Italy, uh, yeah, some uh, Roman beauties, um, food of course, um, uh, famous places, Venice, Florence, uh, Rome of course, uh, some Renaissance art, um, fairy tale character, Pinocchio, um, also you will see one guy <laughs> Maybe uh, some of you would be wondering who uh, who he is, but I guessed uh, straight away it's Al Capone, uh, famous at his time gangster. He was American but uh, Italian by uh, nationality, uh, so someone remembered this uh, person <laughs> and it was interesting to see uh, something unusual. Uh, we'll see um, Vespa. Um, I I didn't thought about it uh, when I was thinking uh, what to color uh, for Italy. So uh, some quite unexpected uh, things uh, we'll see in this gallery. Uh, there are a lot of works by Teresa Goodrich for this prompt uh, for this theme. Also, I was surprised uh, to see illustrations by Morgan O'Brien. His ma. Um, Match, match stick mouse. Uh, so we have also Rita Berman, um, Lizzie Mary Cullen, uh, Chris Riddle unexpectedly, Steve McDonald, uh, Fabiana Atanasio. Uh, so there were a lot of illustrations um, actually that you could find in color and I was happy to see all the variety. Uh, let me show what I colored for this prompt. As I was on holiday I um, took with me only PDF um, printed illustrations. Um, uh, this illustration is from a Venice set by Lou Art Dream uh, from Etsy. Actually I took with me two illustrations but I was able to color only one but still I'm happy because it's quite complicated illustration. Uh, with a lot of uh, details, uh, these um, buildings on the background, let me show you, and some flowers, and there are some people in this boat, and there's another lady there, and um, it took some time to think of her costume, what, what colors to choose, how to color, and um, so I decided to make her costume a bit dramatic, uh, different shades of red, uh, gold and uh, to add even more drama, uh, black elements including this fan. I really like how the fan turned out. So it took quite some time but I'm happy with the result and I'm happy that I was able to color one of these Venus illustrations. Uh, everything done with color pencils, polychromos and uh, they went light fast. I took with me um, 
several red uh, pencils from Don't Light Fast and um, because I really like uh, their red um, colors and so I used them for her dress and little bit of uh, gold gel pen that's all so that was my illustration for this theme and now let's um, have a look at all the submitted illustrations for this prompt. Uh, let's go! Non più dry far falon e amoroso Notte giorno di torno girando Delle belle torbando al riposo Ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor Delle belle torbando al riposo Quel cappello, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante. Non ti dry farfalloni amoroso, notte giorno di torno gerato, delle belle turbando al riposo, ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor, delle belle turbando al riposo. Ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor Fra guerrieri po' far bacco Gran bustacchi stretto sacco Schioppo in spalla, ciabla a fianco Collo dritto, muso franco Un gran casco, un gran turbante Molto onor, poco cantante, poco cantante, poco cantante. Ed invece del fandango, una marcia per il fango, per montagni, per valloni, con le nevi e salioni, al concetto di tromboni, di pampate, di cannoni, che le porre tutti i tuoni, all'orecchio fan fischiar. Non più vrai, quei penachini, non più vrai, quel cappello, non più vrai, quella chioma, non più vrai, quell'aria brillante. Non più vrai, farfalloni amoroso, notte giorno di torno gerato, delle belle tremando al riposo, ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor, delle belle tremando al riposo, ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor, che rovino alla vittoria. Alle gloria militar, che rubin la vittoria, alle gloria militar, alle gloria militar, alle gloria militar. Non più dry farfalloni. Amoroso, notte giorno di torno girando, delle belle turbando al riposo, ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor, delle belle turbando al riposo, ma ci sento a tuo cibo d'amor. Non più vrai questi bei panachini, quel cap. Pello leggero galante, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante, quel vermiglio donesco color, quel vermiglio donesco color. Non più vrai, quei penachini, quel cappello, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante. 
Non ti trai far felonia amoroso, notte giorno di torno trato, delle belle tornando a riposo, ma ci sento a tucino d'amor, delle belle tornando a riposo, ma ci sento a tucino d'amor. Fra guerrieri può far bacco, Grandu stacchi stretto sacco, schioppo in spalla, ciabla a fianco, collo dritto, uso franco, un gran casco, un gran turbante, molto onor, poco cantante, poco cantante, poco cantante. Ed invece del fandango, una marcia per il fango, per montagni, per valloni, con le nevi e salioni, al concetto di tromboni, di pantate, di cannoni, che le porre tutti i toni, all'orecchio fan fischiar, non più vrai, quei penachini, non più vrai, Quel cappello non più vrai, quella chioma non più vrai, quell'aria brillante. Non più vrai, far colonia amoroso, notte giorno di torno gerato, delle belle tornando a riposo, ma ci setto a tucino d'amor, delle belle tornando a riposo, Marci setto ad un cino d'amor, che rovino alla vittoria, alla gloria militar, che rovino alla vittoria, alla gloria militar, alla gloria militar, alla gloria militar. That was our gallery of works for the theme Italian holidays. Uh, thank you everyone who joined this color along. And now let's talk about our new theme, which will last until um, the 15th of October, one and a half month. Um, I know that at this um, period of time many of you like to color something um, connected with autumn, uh, harvesting, uh, but to be honest for me it's not that interesting uh, theme, but I wanted um, uh, that uh, everyone would color something that they like to color and I was thinking about theme that would um, connect autumn and with something else to widen the theme and then I thought about uh, Horn of Plenty. Uh, actually I didn't know that uh, um, and uh, it was a surprise for me that in America du during celebration Thanksgiving Day uh, some people decorate their um, tables with um, Horn of Plenty um, they put some uh, leaves, acorns, uh, pumpkins, uh, I don't know, some other vegetables in that horn. And so I thought uh, let's uh, um, color for this uh, theme, Horn of Plenty. Uh, people who like to color something autumny, harvest, uh, they can color like it's like figurative meaning of this um, words horn of plenty meaning uh, rich harvest or maybe a um, rich table uh, filled with different um, types of food or you can uh, color in its um, first meaning connected with mythology some goddesses uh, holding this uh, horn of plenty so let me show what I chose and uh, maybe it will help you to figure out better what I mean. Uh, so, first meaning uh, actually 
the horn of plenty. Uh, goddess is Kokovaya. We have this uh, goddess. I have no idea how to read this. Um, <clears throat> this goddess holding um, a horn not filled with uh, vegetables but with coins. But uh, this one will do as well. Uh, then Divine Feminine, uh, Vishan Ong, more traditional, Horn of Plenty, filled with um, corn, pumpkin, carrots, uh, grapes, something like this. Uh, then I have uh, two printed illustrations <coughs> with goddesses again. This is Hosni Mubarak, <coughs> Dimitra. More simple um, line work, but still beautiful. And another one, it's by Nadia Z. Um, I got these uh, pictures from Etsy in PDF uh, format, but later she um, published a book with all goddesses and gods. I really love this one. Look at this horn of plenty. A very beautiful um, drawing. Now, second meaning of these um, words, uh, fig figurative, so to say, escape to Shakespeare world. We have this rich table. A look at this uh, food here. Everything. Uh, meat, uh, lobster maybe, fruits, vegetables, wine. So that's what I mean, not just uh, like simple breakfast or <laughs> I don't know, dinner with one plate on, on the table, uh, but something as rich as this one. That's uh, what would um, do for this prompt. Zemlya uh, Snova, Tamislav Tomic. I don't have illustrations with um, harvesting, with a lot of uh, stuff, um, but I was able to find something similar. Um, uh, this one, like we have a rich harvest of uh, berries here that they have to. <laughs> um, use uh, ships for taking them, uh, strawberries and uh, raspberries maybe. And another illustration, uh, this one, look at these grapes, a lot of grapes, nice harvest. So I think this one will do. Um, another one uh, that we can consider as Harvest illustrations, Nature Mandalas by Milpameni. Uh, this one, we have a lot of uh, fruits here, different. And another picture, but I know some of you have colored it already. A lot of vegetables. Big choice, a lot of, uh, so we can color this for this color along. And another rich table, Ivy and the Inking Butterfly by Joanna Besford. Not as rich as in the previous book, Escape to Shakespeare's World, uh, but still quite a lot of uh, different nice food uh, that represent uh, like uh, Horn of Plenty. <laughs> uh, we have some bakery, berries, uh, pie, so I think, I think you have, uh, some of you will have better choice than me with harvest illustrations. Uh, so I, I'll be waiting for your completed illustrations. Uh, you have time until the 15th of October. I'm curious to see what you will color for this um, theme. And that was all for today. See you next time. Bye.